Hello world, I'm coming to you live from the yard with the most horrific discovery I've yet to discover back here, okay? I want you to take a good look. Do you see all these little dots? All these little dots that you see? Well, world, those are aphids. This is what you call an fucking aphid infestation of the worst kind, okay? We shall keep you here. And unfortunately, what has to happen now, this plant is going to be destroyed. Porque it's infested. The infestation is great. It is beyond repair. So you see how like there's a fuzzy coating? It's windy, so it's hard for me to get this um, close up. Hold on, let me put this damn thing down lose focus okay this is so gross I don't want to touch it but it's part of nature see all of that look right here in this guy you see all of the little here and this oh god that's all aphids all those little dots that you see are aphids stop blowing in the wind and when I tell you I was down here yesterday I was looking at this plant and it was not like this. So, the moral of the story is you gotta check on your shit every day because from one day to the next, this happens. They just completely take over. Look at that. Look at that. All of that is bugs. All of that is aphids. Utterly horrifying. I'm gonna put you on pause and see what else I can discover. But first, I'm gonna chop this down and get rid of the entire plant. All right, so what I did was I got rid of the plant. I put the infestation over here for now because I wanna take a picture of that before I put it in the trash forever. This is going in the trash and this is what remains of the broccoli. The rest of the plant does not look infected. And so I'm gonna give it another shot at life. And it's literally just got that new growth and that new growth. And we'll see. Hopefully that will be enough. Found some peas. Look. There is a fucking aphid on that pea. That little dot right there is a damn aphid. Yo, when I tell you, I can't win when it comes to the aphids. But look at this giant pea that I didn't even see was here. Oh my god, it's huge. Look at that thing. It's almost as big as my hand. These peas here are the purple pod variety, but for some reason this plant is has been producing green ones. Look at this guy. This one's got some green and purple on it. They're supposed to be all purple, but I'm not complaining. So what I'm doing here, I'm letting this guy and this guy go to seed, like get bigger, as big as they can, and then I'll pick them so that I could save the seeds. And my cucumber plant is growing in here also. This guy, I believe, has a cucumber on it. Or am I wrong? Nope, I'm not wrong. Here it is. Cucumber. Isn't that wonderful? And I got some tomatoes over here. Black crim tomatoes. There's some inside as well. And I think this guy's got some also. And lots of flowers. And I'm going to take you to the tomatoes and the peppers over there. Focus. These are Mr. Stripey tomatoes that are coming out. Right here. And it's got flowers there and there. And this is the cherry tomatoes. The sun sugar cherry tomatoes. Got just those guys here so far but this one has flowers everywhere all throughout the plant. And now, I'll take you to these. 
tomatoes. More black creme. Now this big guy here, I noticed something the other day. It has like a little hole. Let me see if I could get in here. See the little hole right here? I hope that doesn't, you know, fuck up the tomato when it gets bigger. Some more here. We've got some more there. And some peppers. So I topped this pepper plant. Is that ashes on my hand? I topped this pepper plant and it gave me the two new shoots, right? But right in the middle, it grew a pepper. Isn't that something? And it's stuck in between these two vines. There's a little ant crawling. And this is, uh, what is this? Cherry, hot cherry peppers. And then this is my black beauty, purple beauty, purple beauty peppers. And this guy is already turning purple. It also has a little hole. I think a critter did that. But see it already beginning to turn? Purple beauty bell peppers. This guy's starting the ripening process too. Come on. They're little, but they're the biggest bell peppers I've ever grown. There's another one in there. What else is going on? Nothing there yet. My Rome tomatoes. I mean Roma, aka plum tomatoes. Nothing yet. And my squash is beautiful. But no flowers yet. I see the beginnings inside. And my melons. Can't wait. Hoping, hoping for a harvest of melons. And these are the jalapenos. Nothing yet. All right, world. Thanks for watching. Oh, and all the way over there are the cucumbers and potatoes. All right, world. Thanks for watching. <laughs> Goodbye.